Welcome back to the Zoomer. We're almost at a racetrack. But before we go, let's hear our panelists' final thoughts, starting to my left. Ziggy. Ah, okay. Well, we've talked about a lot of different products and different solutions to everybody's uh, aging problems. I don't mind saying the word, like I said, but do what pleases you, I think, is the important thing. Uh, it's your decision at the end of the day, but do watch out with your eyebrows, please. Do not mess with them. I did mine or also your hair. Don't mess with them too much and just live life to the fullest and enjoy your life. I mean, the way I see it, you're the person who has to wake up with your face and yourself every morning. So do whatever makes you happy, um, but be, be careful of that sort of downward slope addiction of treatments that can happen when you just start with the tweaks and sometimes the tweaks turn into a, a landslide. So just keep yourself in check. And I do have to say, as one of the faces of Zoomer Beauty, I love these products and um, you should try them. <laughs> <laughs> I agree with both of these ladies. I mean, uh, it's great that men getting pampered and treating themselves and taking care of themselves is so much more acceptable these days, especially social media. You'll see videos, women doing treatments on their boyfriends or husbands, or you'll see guys doing tutorials showing their favorite products. That's all great, but regardless, do what makes you happy. If it makes you feel good and you look good and you're not hurting anybody and you don't go to the extremes, why not, right? Marilyn? Well, uh, I believe in doing whatever makes you feel great. And certainly these products are wonderful and are very, very, help very helpful. But I have to inject a word of caution here. Uh, I have a dermatologist that I think is absolutely wonderful. However, she has an associate which does beauty stuff. And I decided to have a collagen treatment, which I understand that takes a year until it all is kind of absorbed. However, in the process, she burst a blood vessel kind of up here in my forehead, which is permanent. It's there mm. forever. So you have to know who you're getting into bed with. Be careful. Yeah, well said. And I'd like to add to the note of caution. So a lot of these treatments, uh, there is no proof that they work. People don't really ask. They're extremely expensive. They're a good way to be relieved of your money. And uh, a lot of things which are meant to be done by tr trained people are being handled by untrained people, and especially if you are into things like intravenous, you know, those things are potentially harmful, and you should be careful before jumping on the latest bandwagon. Having said all that, do what makes you feel good. <laughs> here, here. All right, and that is it for us this evening. To get in touch, you can send us an email at comments at thezoomer.com. As always, a big thank you to my panel and to you at home watching. We'll see you soon for now. It's time to zoom out. <laughs>